Hello, I'm Player State, and welcome to a new indie game video. Today, we're taking a look at Battlethorn Survivors, which is another game looking to capitalize on the success of Vampire Survivors. So it's an action roguelike, if that's what you want to call them, or bullet roguelike, or something like that. Anyway, um, yeah. So just looking at the screenshots for this, um, it kind of reminds me a bit of Risk of Rain, because it's like third person 3D. So it looks quite interesting in terms of being different to some of the other kind of survivor games I've played. Um, I do quite like the genre. Um, Horse of Torment's probably my favourite. Uh, I just want to say thank you to the developer for providing me with a free review copy. Uh, so let's jump in and see what it's like. Okay, so we've got a bunch of trinkets. Unlock trinket. Play. What does unlock trinket do? Okay, I've not got enough gold. Alright, okay. So we've got no trinkets to start. And we've got a lot of levels. And a lot of noises as we go. <laughs> hover over everything. And a lot of classes as well. Be interesting to see how these differ to each other. If we get that far, that is. Alright, so here we go. This, um... Where is everybody? Oh, here we go. Oh, is there not? Have I got actually attacked? That's interesting. And I'm not picking anything up. Okay, okay, I'll just hold it down. <laughs> That'd be easier. What does right click do? Oh, I zoom through them. Okay, so I can take weapon damage, raise undead. Yes, give me some undead people. And how does that happen? How do I raise undead? I've barely got any health left. Okay, so the heal recharges. Let's heal again. Ah. That feels like... I don't know. Wait, was my someone shooting at me? Flipping heck. They just, they just kind of like lock in. There's no way to dodge those. Unless I do that. I, d I don't understand. Why am I not getting... Freeze upon a strike. I'm dead. Like, there is no way to dodge that I could see. Am I missing something? Let's try that again. Here come the wolves. Like they're always hitting me. Press R to hold. What? I don't know. It's a bit confusing. Crates turrets. Let's try that one. Okay, so the, the tw turret just stays there. And does what exactly? Fires a random bullet at nobody. <laughs> Heal. Um, what's all this? Oh, because I'm picking up on the back. Rain of fire. Let's try that. Okay. So that just uh, randomly falls down somewhere. Let's heal again. Oh, hello. There we go. That, that works. Doesn't kill anybody, though. Like, 
Uh, I'll take a heal up on strike. Yes, please. Oh, flipping missed, missed the spider. Uh, yes, get some sp exploding spiders. Uh, go on, go on, get him, get him, get him, get him. So I've got to kind of like get more leech, more leech. <laughs> it's a bit weird. Everything's just popping off everywhere. Got to get the spiders down. Increase health by 200. That's a lot. Chance to stun. This is weird because like it's saying pick this again. What does that mean? Does that mean oh, I guess we've got up here. We can see the pluses so that will do more damage. I'm going to take that then. I mean, there's a, there's a certain kind of fun to this. It's a bit weird. Like, it's weird not being able to dodge those attacks. Let's top up the health. Retaliate. With a projectile aimed at a random enemy every time damage is taken. Preemptive strike. Fire projectile towards random enemy on hit. I'm going to increase my explosion of spiders. Missed. I do like the kind of like manicness of oh whoops I didn't mean to hit that I don't know what I got there it's kind of like got a manic craziness to it <laughs> I quite appreciate I mean I don't like that I seem to be going oh I've done it again jeez what was that And the heal's quite generous, but that's because it should be, because uh, there's now so much going on on the screen. Heal potions, increase healing potions by one. Explode on kill. Slow fill. I think we'll get more healing potions. Yes, kill the spiders, because they're ridiculous. Ah, I don't know if I killed it there. Like... Look, I cannot dodge. Let's get more leeching. No, I knew I was going to get stuck by them. Kill them. Jeez, it's just <laughs> everything exploding everywhere. Oh, for goodness sake, what's that poison? I can't see what's going on. Um, weapon damage. That's it, everybody. Die. I seem to have some kind of like explosive shot. Explosive shot, that's what's causing that explosion. Heal upon the strike. More leeching. It is required because of the... Where's that spider? Come on. No, oh, I missed it. It's over there. Like, because these things aren't, they're just fired at you. They've been coded to directly go towards you, so it's almost impossible to dodge them. Keep banging up my heel. Yep, go for more death explosion. I'm loving the death explosion. <laughs> it's hilarious. Boom! <laughs> Give me more of that. <laughs> I want more of it. So dumb, man. <laughs> It'd be nice if they were like, I gotta keep going, gotta keep going with an explosion. Oh, here we go, there's some big dude coming. I was gonna say, are we ever gonna. 
Oh, there's lots of big dudes. What the flip? What the flip was that? Is there a dodge that I just don't know about? Can I pause a bit a minute? It doesn't look like there's any... Also, the music's still a bit loud. And the effects are quite loud. There are no... Um, controls, so there doesn't seem to be a dodge. So I cannot do anything about this guy just charging right at me. Which is ridiculous. Spiders, bugger off. I basically have to just let my... Um, Chance to shackle enemies. Let's go for a bit more health. Because we're need, going to need that, I think, as we go along further. Especially for these guys that just, like, charge at you. Let's have a projectile fire out. Spider. So you just have to kind of dodge those. And then, oh, got knocked by it anyway. And then let my... Uh... <laughs> the explosion just killed everything. More plague. Plague everything. Oh, he went for his charge. Uh, leech. I think leech is kind of necessary. No, I can't get up there. No, I can't. No, get away. They've, they've got the high ground. More death explosions, please. Oh, I missed them. Or did I? Got knocked over. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Cooldown. Weapons ability cooldown reduced. Uh, Rain of Fire. I haven't done that for a while. Got lots of ones. No. I'm not kill there's not as much up here, so I'm not killing as much. Let's head for the spider over there, come on. Like, is the idea you're supposed to explore? I don't know. Like, is there a reason to explore? No, I did not get hit by that, come on. Uh, have I got a lance already? I think I do, I don't know. Let's go for an explore. Let's see if it's worth wandering about. Or is it just a level? This raise the undead seems to be broken because I don't. It doesn't seem to raise anything. Um, go for more weapon damage. Although I'm not really hitting stuff. It's more everything else doing it for me. Yeah, you're trying to catch me, but you're unsuccessful. Yeah, down you go. Uh, what's my turret at? My turret's only at one. Uh, let's go for a bit of turret more. More turret damage. Oh, spiders. Go away, spiders. Oh, little doggy got in the way. Get the spider. Uh, leech, a bit more leeching. Oh, this is the end of the level. It looks like. Ah, can't go more the way, more that, more that way. Let's go this way instead. Uh, let's reduce cooldown of everything.
take out the spiders. Uh, haven't had that in a while. More explosive spiders. No! Oh, knocked over. Knocked over again. More explosive spiders. Missed. Down you go. Yes, please. Death explosion. One of my favorite skills because it's so dumb. Don't actually know how much damage it's doing, but it's just funny. Nope. Oh, straight into those guys. Although I seem to be in a situation now where I'm not really... Oh no! Comes up so often, like. Not really taking much damage now. Because I'm either healing it or. Killing everything with a death explosion. More death explosion! Up to seven! <laughs> oh, these guys have got blue on them now. This is just so dumb. Uh, let's go for some more health. That's interesting. It gave me the health, but not the... Uh... Come here! No, not here! Ah, uh, it's just uh, picking stuff. I don't know what I'm picking because it just pops up and I've already pressed the button. Missed. Do they all die? So that goes quite well with the um, death explosion because it hits things and then oh, hello! I'm just letting all those people hit me. No. Uh, Rain of Fire, what's that at? Three. So we've got two Vitality levels, two Potion levels, seven Death Explosion levels, two Cooldown levels, seven Leech levels, two Lance, two Weapon Damage, three Turret, three Rain of Fire. Spiders, down you go. Oh, got knocked down. Even though the guy's dead, <laughs> he still manages to knock me over. I can't not get Death Explosion. If you're going to give me Death Explosion, I'm going to take Death Explosion. I mean, look at that. Boom. <laughs> ah. You pop in, you die. Uh, I guess I'm taking health. Oh! <laughs> I went through the air. Yep, um, um, again I say, I said it once already and I'll say it again. You're going to give me death explosion? I'm going to take death explosion. Killed him too quickly. <laughs> so much noise and explosion. Uh, the spiders are at level five. That'll go. Go for one of those. Missed. Oh, 
oh, I did it again. It's just that needs to be like, I don't know. I guess because I'm pressing to attack. I don't know how you'd avoid it. Look at them all getting poisoned. Uh, rain of fire. Oh, knock over, knock over, knock over, knock over, knock over. Stun lock, stun lock. Die, everybody. <laughs> Um, is the turrets doing much? I guess we get a turret upgrade. There is a lot of fun. To, I mean, I don't know how much uh, kind of explosive spiders. How much longevity this has? It's going to depend what the other skills... I mean, if... Like, what the unlocks are like and what the other skills are like. But there is some kind of dumb fun to just seeing everything on your screen explode. Uh, Rain of Fire. Just like that. Like, just everything just dies and you just get all this XP and gold. Death explosion. What are we up to now? Nine. Oh, I missed everything. Boom, boom, boom. I'm not, I don't think I'm anywhere close to being, like, worrying about having to die. Because my uh, leech is just getting so much. Um, what's my plague at three? Yes, plague. It's not really, not really much point in taking weapon damage, at least at the moment. Because the explode, death explosion is doing all my damage. It's, oh, it's a, I just noticed that's a rhino. I mean, that, I guess that would make sense that they're charging at me like that. Come on. Yes, everybody die. Like, it's... It seems I get the leech on everything that dies. So I'm just invincible. Oh, no. I don't know what I took. All right. I've gone around in one big circle, I think. Yeah. And I've come back to where I started. Everything just... There's lots of these guys now. So I'm kind of like constant in... Uh, cooldown. Constantly uh, stun locked, which is a bit dumb. I will say that without these stupid skills, stupidly overpowered skills, it would probably be a bit frustrating. Because there's no way to dodge the f spider fire. There's no way to dodge uh, these guys unless you just happen to be. And that was, I mean, I wasn't, I was running away there and I still got caught by it. And there's just so many of them that I'm just getting just getting chain stunned everything is either on fire or kind of uh, being poisoned Oh, I see there's these red dogs that are coming in. But they're not lasting very long. My turret hasn't come down in a while. Oh, there we go. There's one. I mean, two hits from a death explosion and it's killing off the rhinos. Boom goes the dynamite. Uh, I don't think we really need leech, do we? <laughs> when a when a rain of fire comes in and it gets the death explosion at the same time, it's just so sweet. 
Oh, here we go. Oh, we got red spiders now. That's gonna be uh, awkward. Oh, and red rhinos. Might have to start diversifying from an explosion. Um, I'm gonna slow. See what that does. Aha! Here we go. That's a big slow rate. I'm stuck, but everything's dying. Curse. Right, let's go for curse. Something new. You're all going to be cursed. Don't know what it does, but you're cursed. <laughs> it's, it's uh, yes. It's very dumb. Oh, I clicked curse again. Didn't mean to do that. Never mind. I suppose anything that gets within my range now is just like... I'm gonna die to curse. Um, Rain of Fire. Need to buff that a bit, I think. Now enemies are coming a bit harder. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I would be dead there if I uh, didn't have these stupidly overpowered skills. Although maybe it's meant to be like that, I don't know. But like, I would have just got mowed down. Because like, they just beeline for you. Then it needs a dodge or something. Um, let's see, just for science, let's see if the slow field doesn't give me any more help. In terms of not being perma-stunned. I'm kind of, that's kind of where we are now. I'm getting perma done. Still not close to dying though. A bit more slow field. Might eventually start working in terms of being able to dodge away. But it feels a bit weird that you have to take skills to, I don't know, is it is that wrong to take skills that help you defeat certain enemies? I guess that doesn't give you, kind of like removes choice. Everybody die on the horizon. Oh, hello, what's that? Got some kind of new bar at the top. I have no idea. Oh, is that the boss? Uh, let's just go leech. No, get away. <laughs> Permanently stunned. He's dying anyway. <laughs> I just can't die. I'm getting permanently stunned by absolutely everything because I'm in a bad choke point. But it doesn't matter because everything is just dying. Is that the boss dead? It is the boss dead. Woo! Level 65. That's a lot of coins. So let's just, so I can now unlock trinkets. Click to unlock trinkets. Click to equip trinkets. Okay. So you just pick the trinket you want and you can unlock it. So we've got, oh wow, you can have squad members. That's cool. A wolf companion. Oh, and that's why you get to choose. Okay, so it does. it's doing some neat stuff this game. Um... Like, I still think, so, 
there is a certain amount of fun to the kind of just craziness that is ha happening. Um, like, it's, this is the first kind of Survivor-style game that I've played where I felt stupidly powerful from the start. Well, not from the start, but like quite early on. But on the flip side of that, if it doesn't have that, the spiders, you can't avoid their hits, so you're always going to take damage. The same with the rhinos. So you just get constantly... As you saw at the end, I was getting constantly permanent stunned. If I didn't have all of that leeching health, would I be dead? Probably. Um, so, yeah, it's kind of like... Does some things good, and then other things not so good. Like, I like the idea of having companions, um, and then being able to give them specific stuff. Um, there's a lot of companions here, which is pretty cool. And there's quite a lot of classes as well. So it seems like there's a fair amount to this game. If it look, Even if it looks a bit... I mean, the graphics are kind of like... They look like stuff you buy off the Epic Store, for instance. Not saying that they are. I don't know if they are or not. They might have been designed themselves, but it kind of look, has that kind of feel to it. Um, so yeah, it's kind of a weird one. On one hand, it's incredibly fun. That I had a lot of fun just blowing everything up. <laughs> but on the other hand... I don't know how good it actually is because the enemy design feels very cheesy and it tend it ended up being a bit of a cakewalk. But there are lots of levels, so maybe it gets a bit harder and maybe kind of you have to think about your build a bit more as you go. But it's a good enough fun. Um, I'm not sure when it's out. I think it was meant to be out this week, but the Steam page is just saying coming soon. Um, if it's kind of like your normal Survivor style, three pounds, four pounds, then I think it might be worth having, giving a look if you're into these kind of games. Um, but yeah, I, I, had, I did have fun. Um, it didn't, I didn't start well with that first death, but after that, some of the skills are ridiculous and a lot of fun. So that was Battle Thorn Survivors. Uh, I'll put a link in the description below for the Steam page if you want to check it out. Um, you can wishlist it and then get it when it comes out. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, I'd really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe. It really helps my channel, really helps the videos make their way through the YouTube algorithm. Uh, maybe even leave a comment. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you again next time.